according to the trademark application for American Riviera Orchard obtained by DailyMail.com, Meghan Marco's new lineup will feature edible oils and fats, jellies, jams, and spreads made of legumes, garlic, and sesame, as well as nut and fruit butters. The trademark filing also shows Meghan plans to sell recipe books so you too can eat like a modern-day royal. Dad, it's typical. A big flashy announcement with a trademark application and a half-baked plan of some sort that only makes sense to her. Megan launched American Riviera Orchard last week with a video of cooking, which was posted to the brand's new Instagram account. It's being seen as a major part of a relaunch and is the new incarnation of the take, her lifestyle website that she ran before meeting Prince Harry when she was an actress on the TV show Suits. All that's been revealed about the brand so far is a series of nine cryptic Instagram posts making up the logo of the brand alongside the name American Riviera Orchard. Comments have been disabled on the Instagram posts, and the page links to a new website of the same name where people can enter their email address and join the waitlist. However, the application for the U.S. trademark does give more clues as to what Megan has planned. The listing says that the products will include downloadable cookbooks and recipe books as well as printed copies. Among the items will be coffee services and tableware, servingware for food and drinks, decanters, dinnerware, napkin rings, table place card holders, and beverage ware. Megan plans to sell tablecloths, placemats, napkins, kitchen linens, and gift wraps of fabric. Other products will include jellies, jams, marmalades, fruit preserves, edible oils and fats, vegetable-based spreads, legume-based spreads, nut-based spreads, garlic-based spreads, sesame-based spreads, dairy-based spreads, nut butters, and fruit butters. Notably, in the owner of Mark section, Megan named her company Knows Best LLC. It was discovered that she copied the name of an American reality TV show hosted by Martha Stewart called Martha Knows Best, which was a gardening and home series with celebrities. But now, Megan copied the name of the show and changed it into Mama Knows Best. For those who don't know, Martha Knows Best was an American reality television series which aired on HGTV. Filmed during the pandemic, it followed Martha Stewart at her Bedford, New York farm as she completed gardening and other household projects, surprised fans, and dispensed domestic advice to her celebrity friends. Its second season focused on autumn and winter holiday projects. Plagiarism never stops, does it? You can just imagine the words rolling around in her head, Martha knows best. What will work like that? Martha knows best. Imitation may be flattering, but when it borders on copyright infringement, that's a whole different story. Even Martha Stewart herself might raise an eyebrow at Megan's blatant attempt to mimic her image. After all, reinvention should come from within, not by stealing someone else's playbook. Megan is not a Martha Stewart. There's only one Martha, and she's been doing what she's been doing for a very long time and is quite good at it. Well, it's going to be hysterically funny when Megan's trademark application is denied. I can't see it being approved, as so many businesses in the area seem to have very similar names, and she apparently doesn't even own an orchard.